Good day, my beloved friends and seekers of truth. I'm thrilled you've joined us today for a revelation that will change the way you perceive success and achievement. Get ready to dive into the extraordinary as we expose the divine keys to life that will empower you to accomplish any task. Whether you're on a spiritual path or just curious about life's essence, today's message is a beacon of enlightenment for all. Picture a life where success is not an elusive dream, but a tangible reality waiting to be embraced. Our journey begins with the profound words of the Apostle Paul, who professed, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Yes, my friends, all things. Can you comprehend the magnitude of this declaration? The secret doesn't lie in our own abilities, but in the boundless strength we derive from our connection with the divine. This truth is echoed in Psalm 121 too, which reminds us that our help comes from the Lord, the creator of heaven and earth. It's time we tapped into this cosmic assistance. There's a force beyond our grasp, a divine power waiting to guide us to our desired success. We then journey to Proverbs 3, 5, 6, where we're advised to trust in the Lord with all our hearts and to submit our ways to him. Envision your paths being straightened, your journey being guided by divine wisdom. Surrender your plans and let the Almighty direct your steps. And it doesn't end there. In Matthew 19, 26, Jesus himself affirms, With man this is impossible, but with God all things are possible. Picture that, the impossible becoming possible, the insurmountable becoming manageable, all through the power of faith. James 1, 5, 6 encourages us to ask God for wisdom, to believe without a shred of doubt. Prayer becomes our link to the divine wisdom that surpasses human comprehension. Seek, believe, and you shall indeed receive. In conclusion, we stand at the brink of a life transformed. The secrets to life and accomplishing any task lie in acknowledging our dependence on Christ, placing our trust in the Lord, surrendering our ways, and seeking divine wisdom through prayer and unwavering faith. The key lies not in our own abilities, but in the limitless strength found in our connection with the divine. Psalm 121 2 echoes this truth, reminding us that our help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. This statement is a beacon of hope and a call to trust. Trust is a fundamental cornerstone in our relationship with the divine. It is the act of surrendering our worries, our doubts, our plans into the hands of the Almighty. The book of Proverbs, chapter 3, verses 5 and 6, beautifully encapsulates this idea. It reads, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to him, and he will make your path straight. Imagine that, friends, trusting so deeply, surrendering so completely that your every path becomes straight, your every step divinely guided. Now, as we navigate the winding roads of life, we often encounter towering mountains of challenges, seemingly impossible tasks. But here's a secret, a divine revelation, Matthew chapter 19, verse 26. Jesus himself declares, With man this is impossible, but with God all things are possible. Let those words sink in, the impossible becoming possible, the insurmountable becoming achievable. All it takes is trust and surrender. Trust in the divine, surrender your plans, and watch as the impossible becomes your reality. So let's take this journey together, friends. Let's trust, let's surrender, and let's witness the extraordinary power of faith. Picture that, the impossible becoming possible, the insurmountable becoming achievable through the power of faith. James 1, 5, 6 encourages us to ask God for wisdom, to believe without doubt. This scripture is an open invitation for us all, a divine call to seek wisdom beyond human comprehension. It is a beacon of hope, shining brightly in our journey to accomplish any task. Prayer, my friends, is our lifeline, our direct line of communication with the divine. It is the means through which we ask, seek, and knock on the doors of celestial wisdom. It is through prayer that we express our deepest desires, our fears, our hopes, and our dreams. But merely asking is not enough. The scripture emphasizes belief without doubt. This is not a passive belief, but an active, vibrant, and unwavering faith. A faith that transcends the visible, the tangible, the understandable. A faith that dives into the realm of the divine that clings on to the promise of God's wisdom. Belief without doubt is the fertile soil where the seeds of divine wisdom take root, grow and flourish. 
It is the firm foundation where dreams are built, where the impossible becomes possible, where tasks are accomplished not by might nor by power, but by the Spirit of God. Belief without doubt is the key that unlocks the door to divine wisdom. It is the fuel that ignites the flame of understanding, the wind that propels us towards our goals, the compass that guides us through the maze of life's challenges. And so, my friends, let us seek, let us believe, let us doubt not, for in seeking and believing we open ourselves up to receive the divine wisdom that leads to success. Seek, believe, and you shall receive. In conclusion, my friends, we stand on the precipice of a life transformed. The secrets to life and accomplishing any task are not found in worldly wisdom or human strength. They lie in recognizing our dependence on Christ, in understanding that we can do all things through Him who strengthens us, trusting in the Lord with all our hearts and surrendering our ways to Him. We invite divine intervention, guidance and wisdom into our lives. When we seek divine wisdom, we tap into a source of knowledge and understanding that surpasses our own. This is the extraordinary journey we are invited to embark upon. Remember, the impossible becomes possible when we allow the divine to guide our steps. So, are you ready to embrace these secrets? Remember, you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen.